The form and function of the superstructure of a building is readily evident to most people. But the form of the foundation system beneath the soil is generally not readily apparent, and people often do not recognize how it interacts with the soil to maintain the integrity of the superstructure. The soil beneath the structure has a stiffness which relies on its moisture content, density, and composition. Buildings also have a stiffness depending on material property and geometry, as does the foundation that transfers the building load to the soil. How these stiffnesses interact plays a key role in the design and performance of a building. The soil stiffness can be compared to the stiffness of a spring, and the soil beneath the foundation can be considered to be a series of springs. Consider a load placed over this series. Compression is seen in the springs as the load gets distributed based upon the relative stiffness of the springs and platform carrying the load. This interaction between the stiffness of the structure loading the soil and the stiffness of the soil resisting the load, which affects the pattern of stress distribution and settlement of soil, is referred to as soil structure interaction. To illustrate this interaction effect, let us focus on how two extremes of foundation stiffnesses, completely flexible and completely rigid foundations, behave on a clay soil. An experimental setup is prepared with the clay soil compacted in several layers. Certain layers of clay soil have been colored to make the observation easier. Let's place a completely flexible foundation on the soil. This foundation can be thought of as a plastic sheet with essentially no stiffness. The stiffness of the foundation produces uniform distribution of contact stress, which leads to differential settlement beneath the foundation. More settlement in the soil is noticed under the center than under the edges of the foundation. When a rigid foundation is placed on the clay soil, it can be noticed that the settlement pattern is uniform across the foundation due to very high stiffness of the foundation. Here the contact stress distribution beneath the foundation is non-uniform. The stresses at the edge of the foundation are very high, and the stresses in the middle of the foundation are relatively low. In practical applications, foundations are neither perfectly flexible nor infinitely rigid, making the actual stress distribution and settlement observed fall between the extreme values that were presented here. If a foundation is relatively flexible or stiff, the soil structure interaction will react in such a way to make the settlement or the stress distribution in the soil more even, thereby making the soil structure interaction significant and beneficial which is important for the performance of a building.